Hello, my name is Kaymond, and welcome back to another episode of Imperial SMP. In today's episode, I'll show you how you can get unlimited fuel in Minecraft. I will also do some more progress around my mega Tesla coil base. So yeah, let's go. So, as you can see, I have done some more progress to my base. And check that out. Still not finished though, but in today's episode, it should be done. Mostly. And down here inside these chests, I have some mossy stone bricks, some stone bricks, and a cracked stone bricks. And with these three blocks, I'm gonna decorate this base. I might also add some moss, moss blocks here and there, but I'll have to figure that out once I start building it. I'm not that great at decorating stuff, or building stuff, or designing stuff, except, you know, redstone. But, just gotta say, this has been so much fun to make this project. And I've learned so, so much. But yeah, I can't wait to go back downstairs underground and do some redstone. <laughs> so let's get down underground and go build ourselves a awesome bamboo farm. So we can fuel our super smelter we made in the last episode. Now in here, inside this hopper minecart will go the bamboo. Now when the hopper minecart is full, this piston will activate and boom, the minecart goes round and around and around until it's empty. And once the minecart is empty, this thing here will detect it and send it back in here. And right now it should be empty. Yeah. So let me take out my redstone box. Let's place it in here. And let's take out some rails and some redstone torches. I also need my silk touch, silky pickaxe. And yeah, let's go. Turns out that I don't have enough rails for his side, so that sucks. Which means I had to go do some mining, unless someone was selling me some gold. And by the way, I don't know if you realized this already, but the walls in here used to look like these. So there were lots of diorite, granite, dirt, and look at that. That looks so clean. Maybe even too clean, right? These pants. That are, that are Easy's pants. I sold them back to him. And... I got a stack of diamonds. I don't even feel bad. <laughs> I don't even feel bad. I should, right? I should feel bad. But hey, a stack of diamonds is a stack of diamonds. And I need diamonds quite badly. Right now, I mean, I am kinda rich. I had three stacks of diamonds. Plus 11 netherite things. Oh, by the way, speaking of netherite, I think we should upgrade some tools, right? Oh, hoo, hoo, hoo. Thank you, thank you nice people. So Lores just gave me loads and loads of gold. Such a nice dude. And a lifesaver. This literally saved me so much time. And yeah, go subscribe to Lores. Oh and by the way, check this out. Thank you for your business from Easy. So what do we have here? Undying totems. Okay, that's kind of kind of nice. Thanks, Easy. That's super nice of you. That's so nice. Look at that dude. What is he doing? No one knows. Because he's a weird guy. I mean, just look at these next few clips. You can just make this up. Like, you just can't. This is so weird. Don't hurt me. I'm your dad. Oh. <laughs> that's that's kind of weird. Not he gonna likes lie. You. Oh, so this is what Teletubby babies look like. Yeah. <laughs> They're no. usually a lot slimier than this, though. Aw. No! 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 <laughs> Come on, Junior. Come back in here. Junior. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> take the ender pearl. If this is my first death, this would be so embarrassing. Take the ender pearl, take the ender pearl. Yes. <gasps> Break it! <gasps> He's a <sighs> feisty little bugger. That Just like close. his dad. <laughs> Just like his dad, just like his old man. <laughs> Why is this even oh. funny? Oh, some dragon sauce. Oh, that's dragon. probably what he eats, dude. Yeah. Exactly. That's what to... he eats. Please don't call it dragon sauce. No, that's what it is, dude. Don't. Well, don't. Creeper, creeper, Lucas. creeper, creeper. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I tried to warn you, man. <laughs> Poor easy well, congratulations, junior. Sev. I would like to know where that creeper came from. It came right behind you, man. <laughs> mm. 
I tried to warn you. I tried. I heard both of you saying that, but I, for some reason, it was like they're not talking to me. <laughs> <laughs> I turned around, just saw that green face, and ran. <laughs> but anyways, we gotta go down here. Take out first of all my ender chest, and ten two solar boxes. So first, let's take out some smooth stone. And I have loads of smooth stone, as you can see. And then, I mean, let's start building, I guess. So we gotta start going around with smooth stone all the way around all of these dirt patches. So let me do that and see you guys in a bit. I mean, just look at this already. This looks so nice. Like, what the heck? This is so amazing. Oh, look at that. Beast a block. Wait a moment. Is that... That's okay, right? I mean, I guess we had to try this out anyways. Country load. Take me home. Second row. <laughs> I told you he's a weird guy, okay? Anyways, placing down the blocks. On the grass patches, we'll place down or plant the kelp, not the kelp, but the bamboo. And yeah, on top of these sides will go the peach stones. The nice, nice peach stones. Observers. Some more, well, blocks, I guess. <laughs> and yeah, we also need lots of pumpkins here. I mean jack o lanterns not pumpkins, but jack o lanterns But oh boy, I can't wait to get this done, because this is gonna be so amazing. Just so, so, so amazing. Just look at that. The progress. I gotta place some torches down though, because I'm afraid the creepers will blow up here and destroy my beautiful, beautiful farm. Hopefully that's not gonna happen, but yeah, you never know, you never know. Creeper, you Lucas! creeper, creeper, creeper. Oh. <laughs> Now let's start by doing this side first. So, pistons. Let's see how many pistons we need per side. Hopefully, I should have enough. Okay, so one stack per each of these sections. At least almost a stack. Now how many do I have? I have two stacks of pistons. But that's not great. Not great at all. And then on these sides goes the jack o lanterns. Just to light things up. And that's basically it all done. Then we just need some redstone dust behind here. And then we need to plant down the bamboo. And also, before we forget, let's place down some stairs. I mean, the pumpkins look kinda ugly. Gotta say that, but I think it's oh, oh no, but I think overall this looks kind of nice. First side is almost done. We just have to place down the stairs, redstone, and then also of course the bamboo. But the bamboo is gonna be quite easy. I should have lots of bamboo inside my inside one of my chests. So let's go pick up some of the bamboo, some glass as well. If I have any glass, if not. Yo, that's not enough glass at all. <gasps> I have some more. Nice, nice, nice. And then the bamboo. What a easy farm, am I right? Just so... Damn. Oh, look at that. Did you hear that? It's working. You don't have a pickup system yet. But once we do that... I mean... We have an awesome automatic bamboo farm. And... The glass. Yo. This is actually a lot more easier than I thought. Building this in survival, I mean. In creating, it always seems like such a hassle, but in survival, I'm not gonna lie, it's a lot more easier. I mean, I mean, I guess it's more fun in survival, so that might be the reason. But now we need a hopper minecart. Hopefully, I have some hoppers inside my. Oh yeah, also a minecart. 
placing down the first hopper minecart. It goes there. Any bamboo inside yet? <gasps> There's torches. That's not great. That's not great. Okay. Five torches. Amazing. And that's... Look at that. That's a lot, actually. And then... The other side. Don't don't mind me. I'm just gonna steal some planks. Okay. If that's planks okay. Be... Yeah, there. Ooh, okay. And look at this dude. This redstone line back here connects to both of these observers, which means... Go ahead, man. What does it mean? Efficient. Exactly. Feels like you could just do like a like one of those slime block thingies. I know, but I hate those. Hey, these they are unreliable. Like if it goes off automatically, it's... will work forever. If you don't talk about that, I mean, okay, okay. The hopper my cards can break, so that's a thing. Take a break. Then again, it goes the observers back here. Every other block. They're right next to these, we'll play some jack-o'-lanterns. Oh no, the other way around, right? I love making farms like this. It's just so much fun. Just peeling, placing down blocks, doing some redstone. I mean, the redstone here is kind of simple, but it's still loads of fun. I just enjoy doing projects like these. Gotta place down some more redstone dust, though. And the redstoner, after all. That's what they call me here. Just kidding, no one calls me that. I suck at redstone, apparently. No, I don't. No, I don't. Or do I? Maybe I do. Who knows? Who cares? Maybe I have a gun insane. But then again, I'm underground. Placing down pumpkins as a light, light source. So, yeah, I guess that makes sense. I mean, these pumpkins would rot in real life so quickly. Thank goodness this is not real life, right? Imagine the smell. Just how many hundreds of rotten old jack o' lanterns. The smell will be worse than in the nether. And then the last section back here. Oh, yes. Some unlimited fuel. Some unlimited fuel indeed. And this is gonna be crazy. Now I'm just gonna hang around here for like. Two to three hours till all of my double chests are full and we are calling. After that, we don't ever have to worry about using fuel again. Bamboo is so amazing. And that, my friends, is how you get unlimited fuel by using bamboo. And the design itself, it's super simple, but it does use lots of resources and it's super expensive. But in the end, it's worth it. 100% it's worth it. So anyways, dude, this is the farm. What do you think? I like it. I'm... It's simple. It's so damn expensive, though. <laughs> it's expensive, yeah. This whole thing Lots costs like 1.3 million dollars. Yo, no wonder you've been trying to save your money. Exactly. The planes biome? <laughs> It's pretty plain, am I right? <laughs> it totally is, yeah. That's a, <laughs> you are so funny. Thank you, I know. I didn't even die. <laughs> Only four hearts. Now it's time to do some base building. Let's go.
And that, my friends, is the full Tesla coil. I'm still into decorated and stuff like that, but right now you can see the full shape. And I gotta say, I like it quite a lot. But gotta say one thing, that antenna up there feels kinda off. Because I use some iron blocks, they might be too white. So the contrast against the stone bricks seems kinda weird. But otherwise, I like it quite a lot. Why is there cake everywhere? This is so weird. There's just cake everywhere. I mean, come on, look at this. And by the way, if you have any ideas how to decorate this thing, how to make this antenna better, let me know down in the comment section. Anyways, I guess that's all for today. My name is Kaymond. Please consider subscribing, and I'll see you in the next episode. And yeah, today's episode is a bit shorter than usual, but that's just how it goes sometimes. I still got lots of done, like the bamboo farm down there, and finishing my amazing mega base. But yeah, that's all. I'll see you in the next one. My name is Cayman. Bye bye. You might be wondering how I got here. Well, here is my story. <laughs> yeah, but before I tell you that, we're gonna have to go a little bit further back. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's the. This <laughs> is. <laughs>